Oh, God. Man, my head hurts. Meg. Meg! Wake up, Meg! Oh my gosh, there's a spider! Where is it? Get it away from me! Oh, can you two keep it down over there? You've woken me from my beauty sleep. We're stranded on what appears to be uncharted territory, but sure, let's focus on getting some sleep. Don't you wisecrack with me, I enjoy my 40 wings, thank you very much. We're up with teenagers to be fair. Oh. Any idea where we are? Oh yeah, I might have an idea. Oh, you do? No. Well then, let's retrace our steps. What's the most recent thing we can remember prior to waking up? No idea. I got nothing. Me neither. This is actually terrifying. Calm down, Meg. You'll be fine. Morning, all. Sleep well? <laughs> Gee, you sure seem aware. Look, I heard you guys talking, so I thought ignoring the situation would be a good idea to loosen the tension. Well, you're right. Wait, Molly could be onto something. We should look around, see what vibe this place gives off. I agree. Plus, surely we're not the only ones stuck here. Perhaps the others are here as well. I suppose this idea is better than nothing. Sweet, let's go. Wait, you mean now? Can we not wait five minutes? Scotty, come on! Ugh, fine. Stupid sleep schedule. Unlikely allies, victims of circumstance, stripped from their former lives in favor of this game of chance. Best friends are rivals, peaceful life for survival. So many new things to explore at the cost of living real life more. Don't wish for dead, just cause your life's not the same. But once the game's in your head, you've got your head in the game, just hold your head up high and keep your friends nearby and that's what. You've got a lot of stuff to learn You've got a lot of trust to earn But hopefully no bridges will be burned In Schoolcraft we animated adventure In Schoolcraft we animated adventure There's gonna be so much to do And everything's better with you and everyone and everybody else In Schoolcraft the animated adventures Well, dead end. Gee, really? Well, I don't recall seeing any alternative paths, unless I missed a spot. It couldn't hurt to go back and try. True. Nonsense! I said we bust that way free. We? Do you have a mouse in your pocket or something, Alex? Hey! I'm not that short! <laughs> right. Well, let us know how you guys get on with that then. If you need us, we'll be looking for another exit. Are you just going to stare at me? Ugh, fine, you guys win. Hey, we got company! Why, hello there. I see we're stuck together. Well, we were just going to look around the place to get our bearings. You're not going to have much luck with that, I'm afraid. This corridor leads to a dead end. It can't. It's the only other place here. There's no way. Well, we just arrived from the room opposite yours, and it seems like there are no alternate pathways to take. I thought so. I'm gonna be sick. 
Have you guys not found anything? Surely there must be a shaft or a vent or something, anything. I noticed a dock system above us, but it seems unlikely that would be traversable. Welp, we're bound. Wait, I think I saw an air vent grate in the corner of our room before we left. Uh, really, Meg? And you were going to tell us this when? I'm sorry, I thought it was a last resort. Forget the holidays. Come on, we need to get out of here. Anyone with me? It is our only option left, to be fair. I'm literally down for anything at this point. So, let me pick you. Meg said there was a grate. So, does anyone have tools to open the grate? Nonsense, Alex. I say you bust a way through. Ha. Now we're talking. Okay, it's open. Everybody, one by one. Go, go, go. Man, it's tight in here. No kidding. Come on, guys. It's not that bad. Yeah, but you're like four foot. No offense. Shut up. How much longer is this? My knees are starting to hurt. Just go. You're holding us up. Fine, jeez. Sharky. Really? What? It's a compact space. I can only look forwards. Just keep going. I think I see the other side. Ah, <sighs> thank God. I need oxygen. Technically, oxygen is all around us. Shut up, Peter. cannot even begin to describe how beautiful this view is. Huh, <laughs> you think that's beautiful? Really, Ben? Was that really the best pickup line you could have went for? <laughs> Emmy, we're not flapping, dead and gone, leave us alone! <sighs> you're so adorably awkward when you're in denial. Now that is an impressive ring. Rocco, you realize that Saturn has multiple rings, right? Saturn has multiple rings? Man, that's not being very loyal. Oh, you and your dad jokes, please never change. What in the name of Mary, Joseph and Big JC is going on here? Oh, hey guys, glad to see you're doing well. Likewise, hey, are those stars? They sure are. It appears that we're in space. How we ended up here, I have no clue. Trust me, same boat. You mean the same spaceship? <sighs> Never mind. Say, have you guys heard from any of the others? Ah, yes. They're just down that hallway there. Cool! So is this like an observation room or something? One of many. Man, this place looks lethal. It does, doesn't it? I could look at this view all day. Winston, you have no idea. So wait, just to make sure I'm processing this properly. We're in space right now. That is apparent, yes. In retrospect, this does look like a spaceship. Well, when you put it like that, I guess so. It's so cool! It is not. Meg, stop being such a baby. It's outer space. Yes, it is. And by proxy, it's the middle of nowhere. Leave her be, Nisha. She doesn't have to take it all in if she doesn't want to. She'll come around. Yeah, I guess. Anyways, this view is cool. Cool? Cool? Come on, Molly. It's better than cool. It's marvelous. It's sensational. It's romantic. Your move broke. <sighs> Anyways, shall we go see the others? They're probably worried sick about us. I'm with you, lad. Anyone else? I'll go. You coward! Ah, oh, fine, I'll come too. Any other takers? We'll catch up in a bit. We're just taken aback, you know? I know the feeling. Right, we'll be back shortly. See ya! Oh, thank heavens you guys are here! I'm freaking out! Lexa, did your Twitter get hacked again? Wes, come on, I'll show you. Seems dire. Incredibly so. Come on, we need to go after her. 
Oh, thank goodness. Please, come on. So, uh, what's the problem? Basically, something's gone horribly, horribly wrong. Oh no, I hate it when things go wrong. Loosen up, other people. How bad can it be? Take a look at the screen and see for yourself. You've got to be kidding me. I wish we were, but... The year is 281 trillion AD! How long have we been out for the bloody count for? The year is 281 trillion AD. We've been here for 281 trillion years. I'm 281 trillion years old. Now, I, I know it's quite a shocking revelation, but... I can't think of any quips. Damn right it's shocking. Don't interrupt. Now, I, I know it's quite a shocking revolution, but things you don't really have any yourself. answers for a predicament. Uh, uh, what? Everybody shut up. You're all overreacting. The time gap has had no negative side effects clearly, so get over it. Damn, you tell them. Don't try me, Jasmine. My head is too fried right now. Ah, so you're also overreacting. Interesting. I mean it. It really isn't the biggest of deals, to be fair. It's not like things can get any worse. COVID! Well, crap. Elisa, what's going on now? Some sirens is going off in the front room. I don't know what it can mean, but we've no way of entering. You mean there's a potential emergency that we're not being told about? What's going on in there? Follow us and see for yourself. Ugh, it's not working. It's futuristic technology. Of course it's not working. I've gathered some more people! Great, we could really use some help. So what's going on and what do you want us all to do? Something's causing the siren to go off inside of the piloting room. It wasn't made to swear. Stay no more. This is a job for my muscles. <gasps> Someone's in trouble! Did Matt really set off the fire alarm again? We're not school, you dummy. Fire alarms exist elsewhere, you dope! Guys, quit arguing and come on. It's time to find others. We're not strong enough. Yeah. Oh, oh God. So what do we do now? I don't know. I can't think with all these sirens. I can't believe it. Me, being by a door. Oh, it's okay, Eli. You'll always be my champion. You get the hell away from me. Guys, we heard sirens going off. Really? I thought you were looking for the bathroom. No, oh, I went before we left. What's the problem? Oh, do I really have to explain this again? Right, screw this. Everyone, stand back. Alex, how many of those things do you have? This is my last one, so it better be worth it. Take over! Now let's find the problem. Find it. Wow, that was fat. Oh, sweet piece of a paw! Is that what I think it is? It's a comet and it's headed towards us. We're on a collision course. Guys, calm down. There's the cockpit over there. I'm sure the pilot is doing his best to evade the comet. I'll go check. There's no pilot. Are you serious? We're all gonna die! On my time. There's got to be something we could do. Pete, you're a pilot, are you not? Yeah, for the cadet force, not freaking NASA. Uh, guys. Uh, what do you want, Sharky? Brace for impact. I think I see a planet. Oh great, we're gonna crash and burn. No, it's our only hope. Are you nuts? Well, we either crash and possibly die, or we get stuck in space, nowhere to go and die eventually. Fair point. I think we're getting closer. Ugh, my head's getting dizzy. Mm. Likewise. <laughs>